Hi, my name is Bo Ratliff. Thank you for joining me for the 30th episode of Anything Bo's. Wow. Um, when I was laying in the hospital bed shortly after getting beat up by my ex-boyfriend Ray who got on the meth real bad, I didn't think I'd make it this far. I didn't want to live. I didn't even want to do anything. Uh, but I just believed in myself and believed in the power of well, myself, and um, I just knew that things were going to be okay. I didn't know how they were going to be okay. I just believed in myself, and that's basically um, just believe. Just You can do anything you want. Um, I have gone through a lot of changes, both emotionally and physically, and I, that's, I just don't even know what to say. I'm just overcome by things. Um, Here's what I looked like then. I was a little heavy, uh, and uh, but thanks to me taking my fitness and my life seriously, here's what I look like now. I don't uh, believe that um, just because you are in shape, that naturally means that everything's okay, but I do believe it can help with issues like self-esteem and sleep, and um, also uh, children's clothes aren't as expensive as adult clothes, so, um, being skinny and little can also help your uh, bottom line. <clears throat> uh, at this time, I would like to announce the winners of the Facebook coloring contest. Uh, these people will receive a copy of Anything Bows Meth Vernon. It's a DVD that talks about my uh, time in Mount Vernon. Uh, it contains behind the scenes interviews and other uh, outtakes and, fe and special features. Um, so here are the winners of the color contest now. Give them all a big hand. Down, I don't have a whole lot of time today because uh, I have to be at Applebee's at 2 to roll some silverware. Uh, but we do have a sponsor that I would like to bring your attention to. Now, uh, as you know, I'm a big fan of baths. And this company called Bath Crush uh, has taken my idea of packaging bath powders in um, uh, recycled water bottles. And they are going to be a sponsor. And... Um, they want me to make a promotional uh, video for it. I'm, you know, I'm not sure if Jerry is going to be the right choice for this. Hi, my name is Bo Ratliff. I am uh, going to talk about Bath Crush. This is a really great product, Jerry. <laughs> this is a really great product. Um, they have lots of things. It's exfoliating, Jerry. Jerry. Uh, it's an exfoliating product. It's made of all natural ingredients and it's great for the skin and also, Jerry, Jerry, I'm not, this is for not for Pit Stop. This is for Bath Crush. This is an all natural product. It is made of all natural ingredients. It is good for the environment and good for your skin. Jerry, knock it off. I don't think Jerry would be the right fit for something like that. I mean, Maybe I could borrow his camera and do one of my own. Um, I do think that it's time for me to start doing my own promotional videos. Um, got some ideas on that. Well, I heard from my birth mother. Um, she sent me a message written on a Subway wrapper. I don't know if she eats at Subway or she works there. There's just so many questions that I have for her. But there is a pressing matter. In this letter, she said that Please get your prostate checked immediately. Um, all the men in our family have died before they were 40 of prostate cancer. So everything else just has to wait until I get that checked out because I am 40 now and um, at this point I'm just on borrowed time. Uh, so I need to get that checked immediately. As a public service, um, I will be taking uh, a camera with me. Jerry is coming over and he's going to... Uh, videotape the process of me getting my prostate checked at the uh, Evansville Health Department. Um, since I don't have insurance or any money, uh, I am going to receive the best health care that Evansville can provide. 
and um, I'm real excited about it. Um, I've not really had a, a prostate exam before, so um, I, I feel like this is something that all men should do, and um, Jerry is very nice to go along with us and help uh, show you guys what it's like and not to be scared of it. Because um, fear of prostate exams uh, probably causes a lot of, oh, hold on, got a new ringtone. <laughs> Hello? Hi, Jerry. Yes, I'm finishing something up. I'll be uh, right down. Okay. Okay. Bye. Jerry is really a great guy. Um, also, uh, I did receive a piece of original artwork from uh, a man named Kent. He is an artist and he has made something for me called a new leaf. Uh, it is made out of zip ties and it is beautiful and lovely and I think it's just great. Hold, hold on. It's Jerry. Hi Jerry, I'm coming. I'm finishing something up. Uh, no, I'm dressed. I don't need any help. Jerry, um, I think we talked about this before. No, I don't. I don't masturbate. I know that you are not This is the right address, but uh... Bo, this looks a little sketchy. What? Are you sure this is it? Oh, hold on, dude. No. Okay. I sure hope they have some magazines. Oh, 343, it's right here. Oh, hell, Bo, I can't get up there. Come on. Oh. Oh, 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 shit, oh. Well, that's the bathroom. Um, there aren't any signs anywhere. You know, they might have some magazines that I could just read while you're, uh, or I could watch you get a prostate exam. Not there. I mean, they should make the health department easier to find. Is this the health department? Okay, come on, Jerry. Hi, what seems to be the problem, ma'am? Um, well, I would rather just like to talk about it with the doctor, if that's all right with you. All right, I understand. Uh, what's your name? Uh, my name is Bo Ratliff. That's B-E-A-U-R-A-T-L-I-F-F, -F, two F's, E. All right, well, I will tell the doctor you're here if you can just have a seat. Uh, all right. I don't think they have any magazines. Um, and then, um, what happened was... Mrs. Ratliff, I'm ready for you. Uh, that's the doctor, come on. Um... Uh, can my friend, uh, hold on just a second. Um, my friend is documenting me uh, for something to do with um, school, right? Yeah. Uh, school, and is it okay if he videotapes this thing? I guess. Come on in. Okay. Um, it'll be all right. Have a seat. Um, where? Oh, my God. Really? Right here. Have a seat. Have a seat. Uh, okay. What seems to be the problem, ma'am? Um, well, I, I need to have my prostate checked. You do realize that women don't have prostates? Um, well, uh, I got a letter from my birth mother that uh, said that all the men in my family have died from prostate cancer before they were 40 years old. And I'm 40 now, and at this point, I just think I'm on borrowed time. I'm gonna need to check your vitals. Could you uh, remove your shirt, please? Sure. Um, can I keep the pendant on? Uh, I guess. It's made out of melted prescription bottles. It's from my new line of signature uh, jewelry collection. That's nice. Right. <laughs> Holy crap, where's this from? Uh, what is it? It's a bruise. 
Oh, um, I've been thinking about my ex-boyfriend lately. It's probably just a sympathy bruise. It's not, um, don't, don't worry about it. Just don't ask no corporate questions about it, all right? All right. So when's the last time you had a prostate exam? Um, define exam. Would you be more comfortable having a male do this? Well, I don't know um, if it'd be uh, more comfortable, but it might be more enjoyable. Okay, let's see. Let's get this stuff started. Um, I think something is on the end of that glove. Oh, that? Oh, let me see. Oh, okay. Okay. Paging doctor, doctor. Paging doctor, doctor. Hang on, I just got paged. I'll be back. You can't stay. Jerry, I'll be fine. I'll be fine. I, uh, she seems like a real good doctor. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna do this, it'll be fine. I mean, I don't wanna, I just, I think that, I don't think there should be any cameras during this Oh, hell, okay? Bo, please. So just go out I wanted go, to see you get a prostate exam. Let me handle this on my own, Jerry, okay? I mean, I can right. hold your hand or Bye. whatever else you need holding. Banana before bedtime. Ow! Whew. Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice! Give it to me. What? Give me the banana. <laughs> Bo, I dropped the gay note for you, Bo. I have chosen you among all gay men. You have no friends. You have no boyfriend. You will bring about my master plan, Bo. My plan to make a whole new race of gay people. Imagine a new world order where everyone is gay. Everyone, Bo. 